Hey, what is up guys, it's Ian, and today I'm going to be showing you how to set macro keys on a <clears throat> Cobra keyboard, one of these. So, these are macro keys right here, G1, G2, G3, G4, and G5. I've labeled mine, because I can't remember. And I got a comment asking how to do it, so I'm going to set up my G5 key for Discord. So, as you can see, it's not set up right now. As you can see. So, what we are going to do, we are going to go to the thing that you want to set a macro key. You're going to want to right click, and this will pop up. You're going to want to go all the way to the bottom to properties. Okay, now once you're in properties, you're going to want to see shortcut key. And it should say none for you. So. Yeah, should say none, just like that. Now what you want to do is go to your board, keyboard. You're going to want to select a key. So I'm going to select it as P. And as you can see, it says Control-Alt-P. Now what you're going to want to do is hit Apply and OK. So now the shortcut for that is Control-Alt-P. So what you're going to do is you're going to click the record button. You will see the lights will start flashing. You're going to want to click the key that you want it to select it to. See, now the lights are blinking faster. You're going to want to type it in what your shortcut was, which is Control-Alt-P. Just like that. And... Then you're going to want to hit record again and escape. Now, when you click it, and we look up here, it should pop up just like that. Now, as you saw before, it did not pop up, and now it does. So that is how you set macro keys on a Cobra keyboard. And in this manual, it says right there how to do it, but that's, that's wrong. It doesn't work at all so that's how you set it up goodbye and one more thing if you want and when you go to set any other one of these do not do control alt or do not press p again press a different key like o there's any one of these keys just you cannot re reuse the same key